In this video, I'll be teaching you guys my move Lucid. So to begin, you're going to start off in end grip, which looks like this. You then want to shift your right hand slightly to the right, so that your ring finger is contacting the upper right corner of the deck. You then want to shift your left hand so that your left thumb is contacting the bottom left corner of the deck. Then you want to split a packet with your right middle, like so. Okay. And you want to make this bottom packet rather thin. So once you've done that, you can have your left thumb move this packet away. And you should be able to grab it between your left thumb and right ring. Once you've done that, you want your left middle to contact the bottom right corner of this packet here. And you're going to use this finger to spin this packet 360 degrees. Once you've done that, your left hand should naturally be in the position to use your index and pinky to clip this large packet here. And with these two fingers, you're going to split off a big portion of that packet. Once you've done that, you want your middle finger to contact the long edge of this large packet because you're gonna be clipping it like so, okay? With your middle, ring, and pinky. So once you've clipped it, you then want to use this packet to spin the middle packet again, okay? And once you're in this position, you want to re-grip this top packet here by having your left index contact the bottom short edge of the packet, like so. You then want to push downwards with your right middle until the packet falls in your palm. Okay. Then you want to use this large packet clipped between the left middle ring and pinky to spin this top packet again. And once you're in this position, your left, uh, your right thumb and index should be free to grab this packet here. Once you do that, you want to pull it upwards and you're going to be bringing this packet over the large packet and that should naturally flip it. And you're going to continue moving this packet in this direction under the palm of your left hand and back over like so. And once you're here, you should be able to let go of this packet and it will fall back into the palm of your left hand. Once you're here, you want to have your right thumb contact the short edge down here so that you can just grab this packet and let go of your left thumb. Then you want to do a one hand cut here on the left hand using your left index to push this packet upwards. And you're going to bring this large packet clipped here back into your palm. And you'll, at the same time, you'll have your right hand move over under your left hand and roll this packet over here. Then you want to close this packet on top from your left hand and roll this packet over the rest of the deck. And that completes the move. So here we have a tip to help you practice this move. And that is that you should pay close attention to the thickness of each packet. Right? So when doing this move, it is very important that the first packet you split is thin, and the second one you split with your index and pinky of your right hand of your left hand, sorry, should be thick. And that is because you'll be doing a lot of corner spins with these thinner packets. Alright? And it is a lot more stable to do it with less cards. Because say for example, if the first packet you break off is a thick packet like this, you will not be able to spin this packet without dropping cards. So always pay attention to the thickness of each packet. And that's our tip.